is there any way to address your queen? I'm sorry, your majesty. How can I be of service to you, my queen? Conqueror of the seven realms, supreme source over the order of magic, and ruler over all people, including those who call you the conjurer of terror, and the mistress of malevolence and mayhem, the dwarves who call you Magora, the mighty mage, the witches who call you Gothamora the great, and the fairies who call you the harm bring your harm, and the giants of the sky kingdom who likely call you by many names that nobody knows because no one's ever met the giants. That's better. You know what they say. Flattery will get you everywhere that's not what i mean that is to say how may i serve you my queen tell me mir am i fair you mean fair isn't just starting right from wrong no you fool i mean am i fair you know like Beautiful. Fair. Am I fair to look upon? Why, yes, you are, my queen. You're indeed fair to look upon. But it is said, beauty is only... Only. You know, I I'd, I'd rather not finish that sentence. Finish it. Well, it is said, or so it is said by probably a bunch of nobodies. Beauty is only skin deep. Huh, I see. Though you are a fool, Mirror, you're a wise fool. I appreciate your honesty. Honesty is a greater act of kindness than empty flattery. Yes. <laughs> Tell me, Mirror. Who's the fairest of them all? <laughs> honestly? Yes, honestly. Tell me true, Mirror, or I may smash you to bits. Very well. It is Snow White. Snow White? Is that so? Tell me, Mirror, where is Snow White? Snow White? I mean to have a little chat with her. Snow White is nowhere to be found, my queen. She disappeared already this morning. Disappeared? Yes, I overheard her talking to her friend, the huntsman. She said she told him she could no longer remain here in the castle, too. So she set off into the woods. Alone? Yes, my queen. I must find her immediately. Where's the huntsman? I'll have him find her and kill her. I'm afraid that will not work, Mike. They're very dear friends. The huntsman would surely betray you. Hmm. I, I suppose you're right. Well, then you will have to find her for me. Um... I cannot do that, my queen. As you know, my powers are limited. Then I shall increase your powers. One sec. Where is it now? Uh -huh. Here it is. Once I place this new enchantment upon you, Mir, you will be able to let me see into all of the, in the mirrors throughout the kingdom. That should do the trick. Oh, about that enchantment? I really wouldn't if I were you. That enchantment gives all the mirrors the power Shh. to... Mirror. I'm enchanting. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Gather reflections one and all. Reflect what is on mind and heart. And little reflections play their part. Whoa! Wow! Okay, hey, I feel like a million bucks. We must get to work now, Mir. Somehow, some way, I must find Snow White. 32,583, 32,583, 32,584. <coughs> Stupid tangles. 
32,584? No, five. Yes. 32,585. 32,586. I just can't seem to get these coffee stains on my teeth. Well, I can't give up coffee, so I don't know what I'll ever do about it. What? I mean, should I give up coffee? These pearly, wh- these pearly whites just aren't what they used to be. Who are you? <laughs> Me, mother. You know who I am. I'm warning you. What kind of magic is this? Who are you? I asked you first. No, you didn't. Say yes, did. No. Was that you before? Before what? Before, before, you know, asking who I was? Yes, it was me. Oh. So... So what? Who are you? Who are you? And why are you in my mirror? Why are you in my mirror? I assume... I'm in your mirror? Yeah. How'd you get there? I don't know. This is weird. You're telling me. Are you spying on me? Because... You know, there are laws against spying on a prince. I'm not spying on you. Are you spying on me? No, I, I was just polishing my teeth. You didn't happen to see that, right? <laughs> I did. You did? <laughs> yes. Uh, I mean, no, it was funny. Funny? I meant it was charming. Oh, it was charming watching you polish my teeth. This is charming to you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I mean, yes. Oh, you don't know how charming it is for someone like, well, for someone like me. For someone like you? Yes. What's that supposed to mean? Well, I mean, I have never really met someone quite like you. I've never really met anyone at all besides your mother. I've never seen another reflection in this mirror besides my own and my mother's. What? Yeah. Well, my mother's had it for the best, and oh, she'd kill me. She knows I'm near not. Are you real or just a dream? I'm real. Yeah, I- I'm real. And you're a prince? In the flesh. And you're out there in the real world? I mean, yeah. What kind of game is this? Oh, it's not a game. I'm sorry. It's just that I have never seen the real world before. What? Yeah, well, it's just that I'm... Rapunzel! Oh, no, it's Mother. I have to go. Oh, no, wait, don't. I'm sorry. Uh Ow. You gross. Hey there, Kingy Poo. My daughter has caught in the prince's eye tonight. Has anyone caught in your eye tonight? Tonight I'm going to the royal ball and the prince is going to dance with me all night long and we're going to get married. And be together forever, live happily ever after. Have little princes and princesses, but mostly princesses. Together, you and me, and me, and you, and no one else. Oh my goodness, dress. Got a picture perfect for the prince. Ah, there we go. Come here. No one else, just me and you, and we're gonna get married. What? No, 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 no. Cinderella! 
and we're gonna dance and we're gonna dance and we're gonna owie out out cinderella where is that girl cinderella what are you doing here where's cinderella i don't know mother She's probably out in the barn talking to those rats again. Or the birds. But we haven't had a toys yet. It's almost time to. Ah! We gotta go. Come on, girls. Let's go get that prince. <laughs> Coming, mother. On my way. Ah, uh, well, I got my sights on you, Kibu. Oh. Much better. I'm on, Sneaky. It's my turn. Almost done. This ought to do. Oh, no, darling, this won't do at all. Oh, 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 this is bad. I've got the mirror next pig star. I know, I know, Speedy. Just hold your horses. Oh, really bad, but not bad enough. Oh, Mirror, this bores me, watching a bunch of dwarves getting ready for work. I'll never find Snow White this way. Just keep at it. I'm sure you'll find her eventually. Perfect. Awesome. Rush, 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 rush. Gotta look our best for you guys. Don't want to disappoint us. Oh, no, no time, no time. Come on, sweetie. You don't want to be late. Gotta go, go, go. Morning, morning, there's speed. Rush, rush, All right, now, let's go. Oh, you're sluggy. Hmm. Maybe. Hey, maybe it was my turn next. I'll be up for even get here, so like you know how slow you can be. Hey! Well, it's true. No, this won't do. Got a dress to impress on your guests. All yours, Sluggy. Okay, time to get ready. The new girl has tidied up the cottage so well. I may as well make sure my beard is brushed. Come on, Floggy. I gotta do my morning exercises. Okay, all yours, Bouncy. Don't worry, Bouncy, I'll be quick. Oh, honey, no. All yours, Bouncy.
Are you hearing this, Mirror? Hearing what? The dwarves seem to be hosting a guest in their cottage. Hmm. I wonder. Well, wake me when you found her. I'm going back to bed. <sighs> okay. Don't do work there. Okay, let's go. And the one, and the two, and the three, and the four. Okay, switch sides. And the one, and the two, and the three, and the four. Okay, step it up now. Yo, come on, Bouncy, we don't have all day. I know, I know. I just gotta get my routine in. We don't have time for this. We gotta get to the mines and work, work, work. So we can come back and hang with Snow White. All right, all right, Blingy, it's all yours. Nice looking swab. Who are you? Me? I'm Blingy. I like shiny things and I cannot lie. No, I mean, who are you? Where do you live? Uh, I live in the cottage in the forest. Is this a dream? And is someone living with you? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I live with my dwarf pals here. You like our crib? No, not them. You have a guest in your cottage. Or <sighs> crib. Oh, yeah, her? She's legit. And what was her name again? Snow White, why? Thank you, Bungie. Nah, it's Blinky, yo. Whatever. Mirror. I'm up, I'm up. What's the big deal? Seriously, Mirror? Oh, right, right, right. I mean, my queen supreme sources over the order of magic and ruler over all people, including those who call you the conjure of terror and the mistress of malevolence and mayhem, the dwarves who call you more than you The witches call you Gothmore the Great. The fairies who call you the harm bring your harm, and the giants of the Sky Kingdom who likely call you by many names that nobody knows because no one's ever met the giants. No, you fool. Weren't you listening? Snow White is dwelling with the seven dwarves. That's wonderful news, my queen. Conqueror of the seven realms. Shut up, Mirror. We must act at once. What's the plan? I have a little something in mind. As you would, your cleverness. In the meantime, I need you to find me that mirror. Find the dwarves' cottage at once. Yes, my queen. Why must it all be so hard? Do the laundry, Cinderella. Wash the windows, Cinderella. Where's breakfast, Cinderella? Why must it always be me, me, me? Is this all I meant to be, just an errand girl? Look at me, I shouldn't be so woeful. At least I have the birds and mice to talk to. I have a home. Do I have a home? Oh, surely there's more to life than this drudgery. I just wish I could be off with my family at the ball, all dressed up and all dancing and dancing. And you will be dancing. What? Wipe those ugly tears off his face, girl. They're more much unbecoming than any of the dirt was. Who are you? Well, I'm your fairy godmother, dearie. Oh. And seriously, there are no need for tears while I'm around. Look, I sent you a clean handkerchief. Yes, that's the one, dearie. No more tears. But how is this happening? Why are you here? You made a wish, my dear, and it's time to send you off to the royal ball. Through my bedroom mirror? Well, yes. The, heart, the evil queen has, sent a, ha, has casted a great spell on all the mirrors in the seven realms, and it reflects on what you most wish to see, whatever's on your heart and mind at any time. And for you, that was me. But I don't even know you. Doesn't matter, dearie. You made a wish, and it's time to see that it comes true. <sighs> oh, um, but I can't attend the ball tonight. Just look at me. 
I'm looking at you, dearie, and I see a beautiful young woman any prince would be honored to dance with. But I have nothing to wear. Nothing a little magic can't fix. Oh my fairy godmother, they're wonderful! And look at your dressing table. Oh my, it's beautiful! And you'll need a way to get to the royal palace. I have just the thing. Is that butterscotch? Your little mouse friend? Why, yes. He'll make, make a perfect footman for your carriage. Wow, butterscotch, you make an absolutely delightful human. Cinderella, is that you? It's me. It's me, old friend. And I'm... Human? You are. You'll make sure that Cinderella gets to the Royal Palace immediately. Butterscotch, reporting for duty. I won't let you down, Cinderella. See that you don't. Wait, any chance there's a little cheese in it for me? Very well. Oh, thank you, thank you. Six white horses await outside. Butterscotch, you will manage the coach. Hurry, for the time ticks. Cinderella, the magic only lasts until midnight tonight. Midnight? Yes, and you must stay a moment longer. Understood? Yes, thank you, fairy godmother. Thank you, thank you. Yes, thank you, thank you. Enough of that. It's time to go. Well, what do you think, Mirror? You look lovely, my queen. Really, Mirror? I, I mean, my queen, conqueror of the seven realms, supreme sources over the order of magic, and ruler over all people, including no. those. No, 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 not that again. Then what is it? I don't want to look lovely. I want to look hideous. Right, you're very hideous, my queen. Hmm. Something's missing. How about a ward? Oh, yes. Yes, that is good. And this should do the trick. Perfect. You look like a prune gone bad. And that's precisely what I was going for. Now, for the final piece of my plan, the poisoned apple. Just one little bite of this and Snow White will be no more. <laughs> mm -hmm. Prince, hello, Prince, are you there, Prince? Oh, I'm so stupid, I don't even know his name. He never told me his name, I didn't even think to ask. Prince, are you out there, or are you in here? How am I to do this? Just a second, Mom. I gotta get the schmutz up. Just a sec, Mom. No, no, it's me, Prince, are you there? Just a sec, Mom. I gotta get the schmutz on my teeth. <clears throat> Hello there. There's no time for that. You must come get me out of here at once. Out of where? Right. So, long story short, my mother, at least I 
thought she was mother to you. Nice no, this time. She came in and well, just who I was talking to. So I came clean and she wanted the handle and told me everything. So many things I never knew. But she's actually really a witch and she's not my mother at all. But she took me from my mother and father after my father stole some vegetables from her garden, which seems really over the top, you know? Anyways, she's kept me here locked this time for my entire life and I've been like, along the whole time. And that's another person, you came along my mirror and if you're really willing to come and find me and rescue me. Vegetables? I know, right? Uh, I hate vegetables. Okay, getting that point here. I need you coming to help. Right, that part. Uh, I will come and rescue you. Awesome. Great. Hurry, please. Where am I going? Right, that part. Uh, it's a tall tower with no doors. Any other distinguishing features you can point out? Uh, it's deep in the forest. Nothing but trees outside my window. What? Which forest? I don't know. The Great Forest never told me. Well, there's the Great Eastern Forest and the Great Northern Forest. So it can't be too hard, right? Of course, there's the Great Forest of Timberwood, the Great Hunting Forest of Hamlin, and the Forest of Earl Boinkins the Great. So you're saying it could be any forest? No, no, no. just the Great Forests. Um, are there any other clues you could give me? Uh... There's some birds, a couple of rose bushes on the forest floor. Uh, what kind of birds? Nothing special, really. Just some kipper whites, jolly wats, specktails, and an occasional morning gale. Did you say specktails? Yeah, we have lots of those here. And I know precisely where to find you. Really? <laughs> Indeed. Specktails are native to the great hunting forest of Hamlin, and they're non-migratory, so hunters will travel far and wide to seek them out. Not to kill them, I hope. No, no, just to hunters, you know, rare bird hunters li like me. We travel far and wide searching for rare and exotic birds just to see them firsthand. You love birds? I do. And then, and thus, I know precisely where to find you. <laughs> I love birds too. Great. Well, maybe when I save you and rescue you from that tower, I could take you to some places with other birds, ones you've never seen before. I'd love that. Rapunzel! Oh no, she's back. Uh, we don't have much time. Uh, quick, my name's... Rapunzel. I, I heard her say it. And your name? Prince Edward Dashing the Third. Okay, I have to go. Please hurry. I'm on my way. Oh, and uh, one more thing. Yep. You're gonna have to climb my hair. Climb your what? Okay, I'm on my way, Rapunzel. Oh, Mirror, I'm so tired of being a prince. All my mother and father want for me is to find a princess. I've been matched to this princess and that princess and that princess and this princess. Not one of them suit me. I just know there's someone out there for me, Mirror. But is this all I'm meant to be? Just matched with some princess out there somewhere? Or is there some higher purpose in this age old tradition? I just wish I knew what I was supposed to do this? Who is that girl? Come in. I mean, like an apple. An apple? Yeah. It's very tasty. Come on. Okay. No, don't! Bobby, I'm dying! <laughs> what's happening there? Tell me what's happening! Hello, Prince Charming. What? Who are you? Well, I'm your mirror. My what? Well, I'm your mirror. And I'm everyone's mirror, really, but apart from one of You, Prince Charming, are the only one who has ever spoke to me like I matter. Mirror, you're real? I am. I knew there was someone in there. 
There's always someone in the mirror. But look, there's no time to lose. You see my master, conquer with seven realms, supreme source over the order of magic, and ruler really over all people, including those who call her the conjure of terror and the mischief of into mayhem. You know whom I speak of. She's placed a spell upon all mirrors throughout the seven realms and wishes to kill the princess Snow White. She was the one you just witnessed giving Snow White a poison apple. Wait, that was the evil queen, the conjurer of terror? The very same. And that girl sweeping was a princess. Yes! Oh! So I've come after all these years of you speaking to me that you must go and find Snow White. Yes, of course, but why have you only come now? I wasn't able to long ago. The evil queen accused me of stealing. I pleaded my innocence, you see. I was framed. The queen refused to believe me and cursed me to become her servant. Ever since that day, I've been trapped in these reflections. Only visible to her. Always at her beck and call. I wish to be set free from her control, and you and Snow White can break the curse and overthrow the evil queen. Okay? But how will I find the princess? I will show you the way. Just take me with you. Oh, okay, but you've, you've just always been going to the wall. Come on, man, find your higher purpose! Oh, there we go. And Here. on we go, and not a moment to lose. Snow White's fate rests in your hands, Prince Charming. So dainty, I'm trying to ever get on the king of snow luck. He fits too hard to fit the shoe. No, he didn't fit to fit in the shoe. Wait. Well, if she wasn't human, what if some witch's cousin she placed a spell on some animal like a bird or a mouse? Or a new and transform in a human form and that's a good idea for the ball. I can explain it. No, that doesn't explain it. We couldn't. No, it's impossible. Even more possible, who would do such thing? Would he transform an animal into a person for some fancy ball? Still, that's where it's like to find her foot, who foot fits the shoe, even if she's not human. Are you Prince? Yes, I am Prince and Pepper. And you are you, Task? Oh, I'm. Well. Nobody. Mm. Well, while you're here, I have a word cussing ass. If I ask mother and father, who are the word stewards? They think I've gone mad. You can ask me anything. Okay. Uh, do you think it's possible for an animal to transform into a person? I do. And how would you know? Because I've seen it with my own eyes. My fairy godmother transformed a mouse friend of mine into a footman to assist me to go to- To where? To the royal ball. Oh, really? Now it can someone. That would be crazy. You're not crazy. I, I was there and we danced all night long. We did? <sighs> yeah. Does this help? Can it be? Is it really you? Fairy godmother, fairy godmother, a little help here. Oh, um. Does that help at all? Yes, yes, of course it is you. I recognize you, but just I expect all the dirt on your face. Oh, I'm sorry. No, you'll love the even coming dirt. I just been hoping to find the girl who's fit for the zoo, so just keep him far and wide. Wait, you mean this shoe? Yes, well, the left one, of course. Now I found the right one. Right one. Ready, go. <sighs> I've never been much for mirrors. Why should I look upon myself when there are so many others to look upon in Bono? And that is why you are the fairest of them all, Snow White. You've never looked in the mirror very much at all in your life. You look for the beauty in others rather than looking for it in yourself. Oh, mirror. No, I've heard, no, it's true. I've heard it said that beauty is only skin deep, but inner beauty is more lovely than any mirror's reflections. 
Oh, Mirror, you are more reflective than you realize. I just wish we could have set you free from the curse. Oh, no, you have. You already did. When the queen casts her spell, she casts it because of you. And now that you're marrying the prince who will be queen, I am no longer under her power. I am truly free. I can be connected with all the kingdom, not through one's mirrors. And all the kingdom can be connected with one another through me. And those reflections, a true happily ever after. I couldn't ask for anything more. Here comes your puzzle now. Oh, hey, Snow, congrats on the wedding day. Thank you. And the lady congrats to you on yours. <laughs> Ugh. I didn't think it was a bad idea to cut my own hair. But I was confined in that tower for so long. Another option. Got any tips for a girl with short hair? It looks lovely, Rapunzel. Just go with it. Good morning, Snow. Are you ready for your big day? As ready as I'll ever be. What shoes are you wearing? Something blue. Excellent choice. I'm still getting used to wearing these, but I don't know why I wear them around the castle all day when these others are so much more comfortable. You should wear whatever suits you. Oh, what is it, Snow? You mustn't weep. It's your wedding day. No, no, it's just I'm so glad to see you both, and I so wish you could be here with me. Oh, we do too. We'll be together very soon. I know we cannot be together now, but I am so glad we can still be together this way. It won't be long before everything's back to normal. Well, I'm off. Oh, you look lovely, Snow. Congratulations. <laughs> Wait. Wait, before you go, what is it like being married to a prince? Is it like they say? Is it a happily ever after? Uh, you'll figure it out. It's a matter of perspective, really. Just take it one day at a time. Uh, remember to always put yourself in the other shoes and you'll be all right. Thanks, gals. Well, I'm off. And well, life wasn't exactly a fairy tale every day, but nevertheless, they all lived happily ever after.